Monday uh, is going to be a lot of fun. The, the moon is going to uh, pass in front of the sun in the middle of the day, well, the morning time, and uh, the sun is going to have a big chunk taken out of it like uh, Cookie Monster eating a cookie. But the thing that uh, makes this one unique is the, the shadow of the moon is passing very close to, to Calgary. Uh, people in the States are going to see a total eclipse and we're going to see a giant uh, chunk of the sun taken out. Uh, the moon should make its uh, appearance on the sun's disk about 20 after 10 in the morning and it lasts for a couple hours, uh, two, two and a bit hours. So about an hour into that, the moon will be maximally covering the, the, the sun. So I would say you know, around 11.30 is just about the, the perfect time to see the, the biggest piece of the of the sun missing at that time. Uh, you don't want to uh, try to view this with your with your bare eyes. Uh, you're still looking at the bright, bright sun. Uh, so you, you need some kind of either uh, eye protection wear, like uh, uh, these uh, eclipse glasses that everybody's heard about. Pictures are tricky. Uh, I don't think your cell phone is gonna work. <laughs> the sun will be a little bit too small uh, to see any detail in your, in your images. Uh, but, you know, people might, might uh, uh, like to try. The other alternative is to, to get a telescope that's got a, uh, appropriate filters on it and try to take uh, pictures with your smartphone through the eyepieces. That's, that's another way to, to, to do it. Or, again, if you use your uh, pinhole projection camera old school system you can uh, take lots of pictures of the image of the sun right on your on your cardboard screen